Okay, in this video I'm going to be multiplying one digit number by a three and a four digit number using a written method. As you know from previous experience, this is the standard form. Of the standard method. Okay, and this is the grid method. Okay. So basically all I'm going to be doing is multiplying the 8 times the 5, 8 times the 20, and then 8 times the 300. And I'm going to be making sure that I put the correct digits into the correct columns. And um, I, will, I would uh, double check by either doing a division question, which would uh, help me check my work using because it's the inverse of multiplication. Uh, or I could just simply do the, do the multiplication again and double check. Okay, so 8 times 5 is 40. The 4 goes into the tens column. Okay. 8 times 20 is 160. Add 40 is 200. 300 times 8, sorry, 300 times 8 is 2,400 plus another 2 is 2,600. Okay, so that's 2,600. All right, now, uh, obviously because it's multiplication, I could do a division question. So 2,600 divided by 325 is... Yes, it's 8. Okay, so I have checked that. That looks to be correct. Okay, now the grid method, uh, very simple. You multiply this number by these numbers along the top. You will get answers here. And then you just write them down and add them. So it's a little bit of multiplication and adding. Uh, very much like this would be. Okay, so uh, 8 times 1,000 is 8,000. And like the 8,000 here. And 8 times 300 is 2,400. Right, 2,400 here. And I'm trying to keep my digits in the correct columns here. Uh, I don't have squared paper, so I'm just doing the best I can. Uh, 40 times 8 is 320. Right, 320. And 5 times 8 is 40. Right, 40. And now I just add it up. Okay, so 0, 0, 0, 0. 40 and 20 is 60. 300 and 400, 700. 2,000 plus 8,000, 10,000. Okay, so that means that 8 times... 1,345 equals 10,760. The grid method is very easy to check because you can actually see each of the steps. So uh, is 8 times 1,000, is 8 times 1,000, 8,000? Yes, that's correct. 8 times 300, 2,400, that's correct. 8 times 40, 320, that's correct. 8 times 5 is 40. And I've written all the numbers in here correctly, yes, and 0, 0, 0, yes, 40 plus 20 is 60, yes, 300 plus 700, 300 plus 400 is 700, yes, and 2,000 plus 8,000 is 5,000, okay, so that's correct, that's correct, okay, and that is how you multiply a one-digit number by a three or four-digit number. Good luck.